guys welcome to my channel is a girl if you're kimura here if you're out here thank you so much for coming back and if you're new here please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell for more of interesting content in today's video i'm going to learn how to fly a drone for the first time actually i don't own a drone sometimes i borrow from a friend and today innocence is going to be my tutor and he's going to teach me how to fly a drone for the first time so without wasting much time let's get right into the video let's go so we are going to try flying it here in my area here is uh, santasi atasuma so yeah i live around here so i have moved to a quiet uh, area to do the flying yeah so let's welcome innocent keep watching the drone pilot and then watch this okay, what's up guys <laughs> innocent here uh, today we are going to um, learn the services of how to fly a drone and things um, she's flown it once and uh, i think when i bought the, the drone at first uh -huh. but today she's going to it's learn just proper. One test, uh, today she's going to learn proper so um we've got a drone here what this, type this is the dji mini 2 okay and so it shoots in 10k 4k and then 60 frames per second 30 frames and it's very small and cute you can go and check the the review of this drone on my youtube channel so this is how it basically looks like and this is what she's going to fly so first of all you're going to unfold yes unfold it i mean that one you already know how to do it here and then you're going to set it up very nice and quickly she's going to do most of the work i'll be behind the camera most of the time i just need to show her how it's done and then we are just going to get to it i'm going to turn it on yeah so you take off the cap right like that and then you're going to double press on this one and hold to turn it on it's on all right so now you can place it somewhere safe or you can hold it like this if you don't want it to catch dust and all those things so you can hold it like this or since this place is cemented you can put it on there because it wouldn't attract like a lot of Vutro. yeah all right so the next thing is the controller which is very important this is what you're going to use to control the drone so for this one you are going to need a phone any phone that supports the dji mini fly app or the dji fly app okay so you get your phone you get your app you download your app me. i'm talking to you i thought i was is that, <laughs> is that i was i was a teacher right? i thought i was, I you was are teaching me yeah so so you're going to get this phone or any other phone that supports the the dji fly and then you're going to connect your phone to the, the controller so this is the iphone x with support of course so you're going to place it in here in between this place right like that and then you are going to connect the controller to the phone using this cable right over here so the you're cable me. i'm telling you <laughs> yeah so you connect it like that and then you are going to over here you have the controller this is what you'll be using to control it okay so you're going to pull one like this and fix it in here so you do the other one and now you turn on the controller so you double click on the I say double click, double, double click. press, <laughs> double press on it. All right. It's on. The next thing is to open the DJI app. It's open. And then, yes, it's open. So now we are ready to fly. Rule of thumb: so to fly the drone, you are going to to start it, of course. It's on. The, the drone is on. So to start it, you are going to hold these two, okay, and press it down. Okay, so we hold and press it down. Ah. And, it and then whilst it's it's on, you've not launched it yet. If you hold the left one and press it down for about five seconds, it stops. Okay. okay. Yeah. So 
It's like uh, lunching. Yeah, like the two of them. Press it down together. It's early. So I can and leave. Yeah, you can leave it like that. And whilst it's not flowing into the air, when you press this one down for about five seconds, it's going to stop it. Exactly. Okay. okay. So the next things you need to know, these are the only two things you are going to basically need. Okay, so the left side here is for up, down, and then rotation. Okay. So if you want it to go up. When you, if you want it to go up. You use your left hand to go up. Up. So after you down. press, you double press it, you can use this one, fly it up, sorry. And then this one, you bring it down, fly it down. And then this one is used for rotation. So it here, and uh, yeah. a knee left Yes, it, it does. So the left side, it rotates to the left. The right side, it rotates to the right. And the right side here is forward, back. back left okay. and right forward back left and right so this is up down rotation forward back left and right. and when the drone turns you need to also make sure that this one you are not you go the opposite way so when it's facing here you are going forward but then when it turns and it's face here it means that when you press here it will be going backwards okay so uh Ude. I'm going to use the, the, the front camera of the drone to detect to the, 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 uh, the back end. Yes. Phone. Yes. So now I've shown you start, fly up, down, rotate, front, and back, right? So you can just start it up. So the next thing we are going to do is we are going to um, record. Then, then okay. Yeah. So there are two ways you can record. On the controller they've given you options to record so you can see the camera button over here this one. yeah you can use that too when it's in the video mode when you hit on that it is going to start recording okay. and when it is in the picture mode when you hit on this it is going to take a picture okay so you can use that to record and on the phone too you can use the red that red sign button okay, okay to it's start recording. recording yes currently it's recording so if the drone is in motion and you press on that record anything that is showing up on the screen here will be recorded okay yeah. you can record in 1920 and 1080 so currently we are recording in 1080p okay so where is the, 1080? You, the 1080 is right in front of you but you can see it so it's ah, yeah, yeah, 1080. Yeah. so you got we are recording in 1080 just to save space so over here this button you can use it to change whether you want it in a video form or you want a picture one. yes so okay. you can use it to change whether you want a video it, it, or video. A picture. It's right now it's on video. Yes, it's currently on video. Okay. So when you switch it to picture, yes, you can see. The same time you can use this one. No, no, when you double click on that, it is going oh, okay. to switch. So you can change it back to video. Video. Yeah. Another thing you need to note and understand is the shutter speed and then the ISO over here. What it says ISO. So that determines how bright or dark the the footage can become okay so you shift it to yeah so when you start shifting it to the left side yeah go you see that the video will be coming mm, um, dark, dark. Okay. okay so when it goes to the left side it starts becoming dark when you move it to the right side it starts about to i do what i know when you shift it to the right side it starts becoming brighter okay so when you are shooting in let's say a place currently like a place where it's very bright you need to reduce the iso when the, it's very sunny you need to reduce the iso and then probably the ISO. sorry the shutter speed and then the iso and when you are you are shooting at a place where the sun is very low or it's quite darker you need to open the shutter and then the iso as well okay yeah so the higher the ISO, the brighter it becomes, the lower. Yeah, so now you can see that it's it's very bright. So sometimes when you fly, you see that the place or the sun comes and the place is very bright. Then you go and reduce the shutter in the stand. Mm. Yeah. So now it's time to take your first flight and record it. Set your ISO well. Okay, another important thing you need to know it's also the cinema and the, the sport and normal so cinema basically means on other 
on the previous ones it was tripod okay so when it's on tripod or cinema it means that it flies very slow at a smooth speed okay when it's normal it's the normal is um in between sport and cinema it flies a bit slow but not that fast as well and the sport is like very fast if you want it to go like shim so if you want it <laughs> shim is like if you want it to go faster you put it on sport if you want to fly smooth and very slow you put it on cinema <laughs> so you move very slow and steady very slow and steady okay Okay. And you can go forward a bit. Turn around a bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Have you started recording? No. Start recording. Okay, go up. Go up, up, uh, up. Go up. Yeah, go up. Some more else. The, the noise will be too much. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, and, and these people, they, they don't like. Are you recording? Yeah. Start recording. Yeah. But these people, they don't like it when you come into their territory. So you see the way they are choosing it. <laughs> Are you at? Mm -hmm. Steady. Steady. Mm -hmm. Take your time. Mm -hmm. But you, you should keep your eyes on it too. I was by the time you realize. Huh? Is anyone? So come down a bit. Mm. Turn it to face you and come. Down. Turn it to face us. And then you come down. Are you facing us? No. Mm -hmm. So come down. Come down. Down. Okay, take your time, then come forward. Slow and steady, slow and steady. Take your time, where is it? I'm going to be on your back. At your back. <laughs> so I want you to come down. Down. Come to us, yes. Okay. Then come to us. I want you to come forward. Yeah, it's okay. Come forward. Slow and steady. Yeah, slow. So make sure it's here before you go down. Cry. Go forward a bit. You got a mind, but even that could change. You could flip the gray matter like some 
batter in your brain. Uh, that's why to say, fake it till you make it, eh? And if you play that game, then you just might make a change. Rearrange all the bad to okay. Take the worst stuff, say, and turn them to a game. How is it like? Oh, it's, it's like you're in control of mm. the pilot. Yeah, and is it Daniels? When they see, see, they see it as their own. So they are coming mm -hmm. to have child. Or they, are, if they think they are coming to attack them. So they want to attack you. They want to attack you. They want to attack it. It's nice. Can I, should I? 25%. No, the battery is 25%. So we need to change it. Change the battery. So battery, they are flying. Yeah, so every battery flies in maximum 30 minutes. But this battery was in full. So that's why it's low. And when you fly it maximum 30 minutes it should be of especially when you are recording when you fly and you're not recording so it high, can high, go how high can it go as high as you want it high 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 higher higher higher, 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 higher. but you know you are dealing with battery and it can go the length to it can go as far as you want it to go it but yeah no no it's not <laughs> so you are dealing with battery so you don't you make sure that it's within your range when the battery is slow you start flying back else when it gets to about 10 percent it will start flying back itself and when it doesn't reach your place where you are before the battery goes down it will just yeah. fall at wherever it gets to it will land or it will fall it will fall when when it's within your range let's say the battery is 10 percent and it starts flying back itself and then it's within your range it can come and land at where you started it but if let's say from here you are at what's the next time after that as much concomacy right when you fly to concomacy and 10 10 percent from that place to this place it might not reach where you started before the battery dies off so wherever it's got into it will just fall down mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me Okay, so guys, officially, this is my first time and I had a very good seal time. Innocent K. Watson, thank you. Yeah, rate me five star. <laughs> yeah, I rate you five, uh, five star. Actually, I've, I didn't know that this is the up and down and this is the front and back. By now, I know everything and thank you so much. And I hope you also watching learned something from it. And if you want to go and buy a drone, I'm not recommending, but this is quite good and quite cute to take it along if you are a content creator. <laughs> <laughs> if you are a content creator, so guys, thank you so much for watching. Can you want to tell them to go and subscribe to me? Please, if you won't tell you, please go and subscribe to my channel. I have <laughs> drone footages from all oh, over Ghana, Adomi Bridge. And I will say it right. <laughs> So thank you so much for watching and also you can go to Innocent K. Boatin's channel and watch his drone Yeah, that's where you live in now. <laughs> You can go to Innocent K. Boatin's cha channel and <laughs> You can go to Innocent K. Boatin's channel and check out his drone footages in Ghana uh, Adomi Bridge where videos of uh, Kumase Tag a whole lot of drone footages to follow interchange. It's very very nice 4K short videos. If you want to know how to edit drone footages, you can follow his channel and learn from him. So it's a girl if you are Kimura here and bye bye.